Hey guys, welcome back to the Cruising Life channel. So as you can see, I have a setup here. I guess you can see it clearly, but I have a setup here. We're gonna do balut balut mukbang. So I have uh, four balut here, four baluts, <laughs> and uh, I have my asin, which is salt, and I have my suka, which is vinegar. And I have some chicharon here, <laughs> some chicken skin. Parang ano na to ah, parang putok batok challenge to ah, hindi na to balot mukbang. So anyways, um, let's get started. So, what you do first, ay, ah, init, ay, ang init. So, what you do first is you just, ow, it's very hot. What you do first is you grab, see, this is the balot. At the end, there is a the white part. I'll show you guys later. And the other end, this is where the, the other end. That's where you should open it. But you don't peel off the whole skin like uh, like how you do like how, like how you do on a hard boiled egg, like chicken eggs. Because I'll show you guys why. So first, you do the top first, and then out. It's just so hot. And this is the tissue. So I can hold it. Start peeling the top, and there's like this is what it looks like first. I don't know if you can see it, it's still steaming. And then there's like a film on top of it, which you have to, which you must remove. Next, you put a little bit of salt. It's like a pinch of salt. And then just a little bit of vinegar, just to taste. There you go. A little bit, you know, accent in the video. And then you slurp it. Ah, it's hot. Mm. Mm. I think I need to remove. There you go. There's more film. It's best to eat balot when it's warm, when it's still hot. And they only have a, I believe they only have a shelf life of one day once you cooked it. But to put it in the fridge, I think it can take up to, up to week, up to one week, up to a week. Yeah. So then start peeling off sides. Still some sauce in it. Mmm. Yes. Oh, it's so hot. Like right beside the window. <laughs> there. Start peeling it. Back in the Philippines, like way back in 2006, before I moved here, um, my cousin and I, we, we get balot, well, we don't eat this every day. Well, I think just like a couple, couple times a month. So, we get balot at the palenque. Ah! At the palenque, which is the market, which is called the wet market in the Philippines. So, we get a couple and then we just take it home and eat it. I think before it was, I think it was only 10 pesos, 10 pesos for one. I don't know how much it is now. So, yeah, I mean, I'll show you guys. Here's the, oh, where is it? There you go. Here's the unfertilized duck egg. And this is like the, I don't know what this is, but this is like the best part, the yellow part. And then the one that I'm talking to, the one that, I'm, uh, that I told you guys earlier about the white part at the end of the egg, you don't eat that. Well, I think you can eat that, but I don't eat it. This is like rubber. I think that's the yolk. Oh no, that's the white, the white part. The, uh, on eggs, on like chicken eggs. That's like the talog I don't know. Shower it with vinegar. And 
a pinch of salt. I'm gonna eat it. Mmm. 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 So good. Mm. <laughs> this is the yellow part that I was. Uh, let me focus. There you go. There was, there was the, this is the yellow part that I was uh, told you guys like the best part of the balut. Just dip it in salt. See, I don't, I'll eat this. I'll eat the white part anyway. So I just take the rest of it. Yeah, it's the white part. It's like it's so hard. It's like I don't know. It's like a, it's like rubber. It's like you can throw it. You can throw it at someone and they can get hurt. My tissue. I also have my teacher on. Mm. Balut is a, it's a really, it's, it's a Filipino delicacy, you know, it's, it's sold in the streets and they, they sell it on a basket, which uh, they has a, it has a thick cloth liner because once they steamed it or they boiled it, they put it straight to the basket and the, uh, the, 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 the liner inside the basket prevents it from cooling. So. Ah, uh, shut up. Yeah. So yeah, it's sold in the Philippines. Well, I think I think other Asian countries as well, mainly Southeast Asian countries. And Vietnam, they they eat this too. Frankly, I don't know. Never been to Vietnam, so. Good. Oh, the eyes is right there. So you can see, it's it's there's feathers, there's the beak. The <laughs> wow. <laughs> they they eat this in the Philippines. I think on a regular basis because it's really good. They say it's really good for you. I don't know. High cholesterol, I heard. Vinegar, sh just shower it with vinegar. Yeah. Mm, so warm. Mm. You know, they say uh, balut is a natural aphrodisiac. So, I don't know about it, but I don't know if it's true. But they say it's a natural aphrodisiac. See, I opened it the other end, and this was the uh, this is where the the white part is. So there's no juice there. So you have to open it the other end to get all the goodness. See, this time. But uh, this time, there's like the hair. I don't know if that is. I don't know if that's the hair or like the nerve endings. There's like there's the balut. Oh, it opened. That's the balut. Yeah. So yeah, ma balik tayo dun sa like this is a street food. Yeah, this is a street food, and they sell it. Uh, they yell balut, balut. <laughs> They, they, they usually sell it at around starting around 5 p.m. onwards because uh, they use it as uh, pulutan as well, which is like the, this is like one of the things you eat while you drink because it's really good and it's really cheap. Mm. So, I'm gonna hit. See, like the intestines and like the balut. Mm. Good that. People right now would be like, bleh, bleh. 
Sorry guys. So guys, thank. I'm just gonna check balut. I bought this at my friend's store. This is around, I think a dollar. I think it was a dollar seventy-five, which is more or less fifty pesos each or forty pesos each. All right, forty pesos each. I don't know how much is it now in the Philippines. Yeah. Comment down below how much it is now in the Philippines. How much is one balut in the Philippines? Shower with vinegar. Then a pinch of salt. I'm sweating right now. It's so hot. I used to eat the white part. Let's see. Let's try again. Oh, fear robbery. Very okay, chewy. Oh, no, I don't like that. Mm. Oh, it's really good. I was gonna do more than four baluts, but I still want to live. <laughs> I don't wanna die yet. I think I'm gonna. I'm so full. <laughs> I still have my chicharro in here. Cheers, guys. <sighs> so, guys, that's it for uh, today's vlog. The Balut Mukbang. Called Balut Mukbang Challenge. Well, it's not really a challenge. <laughs> so, that's it, guys. Um, I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you like it. And don't forget to subscribe. Um, I hope you guys try balut next time. It's really good. At least one, you know, just to just, just for the hell of it. <laughs> and yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.